All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is uh, tournament day, Bass Nation team trail on Gull Lake. So we're gonna go out there and see what we got. We're boat 16, we finally got a good boat draw. Uh, well, a decent boat draw. I mean, it's, it's a good boat draw. Uh, out of 63 boats, so we'll head out there and see what we got. And then, uh, yeah, hopefully what we have pays off. We got a, a, quite a few spots we can run. And if all else fails, we'll scrap everything and run new stuff. So let's get after it. That's a bass. I saw him come out of the water. Okay, now I'll need a net. Well, maybe not. You done? It's a dink. Yeah, I guess she measures. A whopping one pound, three ounces. Amazing. <laughs> One skunk. So, gotta get rid of it. Got another keeper. Okay, I gotta get to. I gotta get to you. <laughs> All right. So uh, go ahead and cast out there. You'll have to cast. I'll just cast straight out that way. Keep them activated. Okay, what's this one way? Zero. One five, that doesn't seem right. There it is. Two pounds, five ounces. That's I say it was two five. Okay, there we go. We got two fish now. Get down there, buddy. Okay, two fish. Ten o'clock. No net, you don't need a net. I'm just gonna flip them in. There we go. That's what's living in there. Cast in there. Cast in there, see if we can get another one. Yeah, the black and blue jig. There we go. Better fish. Yeah, yeah, throw that one right in there. Okay, I gotta dip him real quick in the water. There we go. Okay, let's see here. I'm gonna zero this real quick. Okay, there we go. Three, four, three pounds, four ounces. That's that's the kind that we're looking for. I'm gonna put him on the big side. About to watch him. We had him out of the water a long time, so.
There you go. Good. All right. That situation. Is it? Does that mean? Just got a manhandle. <laughs> Telling down so you got a chance to fish it here. Okay, here's our fish number four. Oh, and he had that thing too. Gosh. Thumb is already sore. There we go. Not a big one. Man. He's just gonna barely make it though, I think. Well, not barely. Oh yeah, plenty. Plenty, but still a dink. Inside reed edge though. It's actually a reed edge I haven't fished before. One pound, nine ounces. This is not our smallest. <laughs> He's being, he's, he wants to just flop like crazy. Oh, it's already set to one pound. Okay. Let's see here. One pound. Nine ounces. Okay. Oh, get in there. Oh, what was that? <laughs> he didn't have a chance. <laughs> cool. There we go. <laughs> Mini leeches. Well, we got a limit, but it's a very, very small one. He went glazed in one eye. One-eyed Jim. Oh, 113. Okay. We gotta replace him with some nice ones. Yeah, get into your shoe underneath your beer. But we got a limit though. So that's better than what we, we, well, it's good to have a limit. Did I say 114 or 113? 113. 113, okay. Okay. No way. Cast up in there real quick. Maybe he's got a buddy um, right up that way. Up there by the weeds. Perfect. Another dink. Well, let's see. I don't know what our smallest is though. I can record those on this scale. I really should start doing that to make life easier. Stop, 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 stop. He's not a 1 8, is he? No way. He doesn't feel like a 1 8. No, I gotta zero this out. There's no way he's a 1 8. Doesn't feel like it anyway. Yeah, one eight. Well, that will get rid of one of this fish. Uh, one pound eight ounces. Okay. There we go. Not much of a call, but. Five ounces. Every ounce counts. Matters, I mean. Oh, I got one. Sorry, I'm just gonna flip them in. Uh, 
I don't know if he'll help or not. I don't know, it's gonna be close. It's like a cookie cutter, like factory size for Gull Lake. Nice looking fish, just needs to be bigger. One nine. Yeah, I can't believe I'm trying to call out something for a one nine. Watch, it is a bass and it's like, Oh gosh, what is this? I'm hung now. Oh, he's still on it. Probably gonna lose him though. Come on out. Oh, it ain't nothing. Not even gonna help us. I ain't even gonna weigh them. Our, our smallest was a one nine. <laughs> Come on, throwing water. <laughs> Good job, got a double. Set them on the deck there. Yours is yours is much better. Good job. I'll weigh this one real quick here. No, that one's too small. There you go. Oh, you My thumb. Nah, he just... I shaved him a little bit right there. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's called bass thumb. Now, you, now, you, now you've got... No, there's no way it's a 1.7. Zero out. It's my first fish of the day, Peel. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, been, it's, it's tough out of the back of the boat. Yeah, 112. There we go. The yep, it is. One twelve. <laughs> Good grief. Not even sure this guy will help. Cast up at that uh, point where I just caught this one. Maybe there's a, maybe he's got a buddy up there. Maybe his buddy's bigger. It's like five pounds bigger. What is your PB large mouth? Oh. Alaska when I caught the large large mouth bass, not not sea bass. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Alright. Don't lower the net. Okay, got it. Got it. That's a better one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's like five pounds right there. No, but I think, I think, yeah, four. Had the camera off too at the beginning. Yeah, let's see, let me see, is it zero? Okay, it was zero just in case. This thing gets kind of funky. See, now it's adding an ounce. I gotta zero it again. Those guys are starting to come over here. Yeah, they've been working that way, which is okay. Yeah, that's a better fish. What is it? 
Three pounds, eight ounces. It's got a it's got a five pound body. We'll call it we'll call it that. After I knock the crap out of them. Knock the crap out of them. Awesome. That's a, that's good. Cool. Man, I wish I'd had the camera rolling. You got one too? Yep. We doubled up. I got a smallmouth. How in the world? I've never caught a smallmouth out here. Ooh, that's good. Don't, don't, don't put any slack in your line. Towards me. Oh, I got him. Yeah. There's your PB. <laughs> All right, buddy. Come on, calm down. Here, hang on to him for a second. Nice and tight. I don't know if he's going to help, so I want to hurry and get the, this one done. Game change your switch and move, huh? Right? Crazy. I didn't know if I I didn't know I had one. I thought it was caught on something and I thought I felt it kind of pull back. Oh man. Nice. Nice work. What a good double to get, huh? Again? Huh? Twice on the same day? Yeah. That's crazy. Jam the pliers in my thumb. Uh, yeah, I'll do this quickly here. I'm not sure if the smallmouth is going to help us. No. All right. Nice little smallmouth going back. Now, for the one that is going to help us. Perfect. Three pounds, two ounces. Awesome. Great. Hey, good job, man. Thanks. Nice. Get rid of a 112. Got one. I don't know if it's any good. Oh, I am, that might, might help. Let's see here, bring him in. Oh, yeah, he is kind of small. Ow! Well, okay. We'll see. Okay, go ahead and set it down. I'll lay him real quick. <laughs> no, that's alright. You good? Turn on. We need a beat. It needs to be to 112. Ah, did you see that? I heard that. That was my skin crunching. I don't think he's gonna do it. There's zero it out real quick. I wanna make wanna make darn sure that that's right. Twelve, exactly the other one. Somewhere tossing back, right? We got a one twelve, one thirteen, and three three pounders. If you guys haven't noticed already, these intros and outros are 
after the tournament because I ran. I just, I, I just didn't have time to do them during the tournament. We were running around in the morning and stuff, and then afterwards just got out of there. I'm I'm, I'm really terrible for doing uh, doing that. So, um, but yeah, so tournament went okay. Uh, we did end up having a scrap. 95% of the stuff that we did and had to run new things. So when that didn't work out, we just ran some new stuff or ran some other stuff that I hadn't practiced yet. Uh, a couple of things were older older spots that actually ended up panning out. The one spot that did pan out was a deeper weed line. And uh, we, we ended up throwing a couple bladed jigs out and we doubled up. I got a, I got a small mouth. I've always known small mouth exist in this lake, but uh, I've never caught one. Uh, it, now it wasn't a giant, it was what a one pound, 12 ounce uh, smallmouth. So, but it was kind of cool, uh, kind of nice little bonus fish. But I really wish it was a bigger fish. We really need a bigger fish. Uh, thankful for, to have what we got and that we didn't zero out. Obviously, well, honestly, we really, there's you really should not zero out on Gull Lake. There's a lot of fish in there, but sometimes it can get tough. It all just depends on what you're running and, and everything. and. I did get a I did get one of my first fish ever on a uh, on a, on shaking a minnow. Um, well, maybe not first fish ever. I think it was the second one because <laughs> um, the first one was in practice. So it's kind of cool. But I wish it was bigger. I wish we got on more schools of them. I couldn't get some of those schools to fire. Um, a lot of our spots where we marked and caught fish before and where I shook off, they weren't there. A lot of times, this is the way it pans out. So you have to plan for those spots not to work, and we we did. I did. You know, we we knew there's a possibility they weren't going to work, and that we're going to have to scrap everything, and that's what happened. So I don't know. It's uh, we got we got 14.41 pounds. Um, it was good. For, I think like 50 something place. <laughs> so not the greatest, but one one more pound would have jumped. If we would have called one of those fish out. It would have jumped us up like maybe depending on the size of the fish. 20 spots so it was pretty close in the middle of the field there were some good bags up uh up in the top though there were some really good bags up uh, up in the top 10 so i mean if we would have called out you know our two smallest fish we wouldn't have been close to them but we would have been better than what we did and uh it was a good tournament all in all honestly um wish it was better wish we had bigger fish obviously but it could have been worse so uh, that's it for uh, for this tournament. Uh, this, this, this is the last tournament of the year for us at the, for the team trail. Um, this was my worst season ever. Next season, looking to pick it up. Um, next tournaments we got coming up are the uh, Bassmaster Opens as a co-angler. And uh, I'm not sure how much filming I'm going to do if I do it, do film there. I'm not sure. First one, first co-angling tournaments that I've ever done. So uh, I'm not quite sure how everything's going to work. But we'll try. We'll see what happens. But thanks for sticking around, and if you guys haven't already, please subscribe to the channel, and we'll catch you in the next video.